So today we're here spring fishing our local estate lake. We're, today we're going to be trying to swim, which we don't usually try, but we, we, we did try back when we first fished it, but we haven't tried in a couple years now. So today we're the baits that we're going to be using. We're probably going to we're going to be using solid bags and. We're using a lot of our new sponsor, Iconic Baits, which are really good and the baits work pretty well. So it's pretty much the first time we're going to properly have a go with them and then we'll see what they can produce and see how good they are. Let's see you when I get down to the lake. So we got down the lake and we put one rod out and I'm just about to put out my second rod. This one's going to go on the point of the island, just on the edge there. So going up. So we're putting in and like this mix into the um spawn. It's got nice iconic bake bait SOS boilies and tuna in it. It stinks really bad, but I fill this up. And I'm about to cast this one out. So I'm just gonna show you the baits I'm using. They're really good iconic baits, so this this is a nice chopped down SOS boilie. Sits perfectly when chopped down. Oh. So, is that your middle rod going? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Well done. That was on. That was on the spot where you've just put the bait, yeah. yeah. Oh. <gasps> it's Tom's one. Remember Tom's oh one? yeah, that's a proper ghosty. Look at that. Remember Tom caught him. Remember Tom caught this one. Yeah, that's a proper koi, isn't it? <laughs> Look at that. Oh. <laughs> well done. Yes. Off the mark. We're like ghosty. I remember, I remember Tom caught that one the other day. Well, Alright. Okay. Well, Should we go and sort this one out then? Yeah. That's cool. How big do you think? Uh ten pound probably. Eleven pounds. Yeah, it's not huge, is it? But it's really nice ghosty one. Hmm. And that was from just out there, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. So, there. All yes. right, well done. Let's go and sort this out. Right. So, this is the first fish of the day on the nice iconic bait SOS. And it was on that spot where we spawned out, and they, the fish came on that area. Oh, fish just jumped over there. But, Nice ghost scene. Oh. Oh, right. I'll have to sort this out and you get that one. Well, 
were just taking photos and filming the little one with the other fish, and then this rod went off. And, and how long have we? How long have we been rods out? Rods that have been out for about fifty minutes, I think. Yeah. And Nothing special. Just a nice common. Quite a nice healthy one. Yeah. That's it. Oh, well, well done. second fish of the day and right on that spot again. Just had a nice double take of these fish here. Um, they were both on SOS iconic bait on that same spot. As you can see, um, this is the one that we caught, but then whilst we were showing it to the camera, um, this one ran off and took our bait. There's a nice double take of like £10 plus commons. I'll hold this one up first. There's this ghosty one, oh, cricket bat, but some nice colours on it. Same one as my friend Tom caught um, not long ago. So we'll take some photos and get them back. Take some photos of them just in there. Alright, so these are the two first fish on iconic baits. One of them is this nice ghosty. And then look at his head, really nice and white. So, row from that spot that we spotted up. And back where this one goes. And there he goes. Then this is the second fish we caught whilst we were trying to take photos of that other one. Bit bigger this one, nothing special, but and there we go. And we'll get the rods back out and put another SOS iconic bait boil easy on it and wait for another fish. So, just as I was showing you the rigs before, I couldn't finish because obviously we had those that double take of nice commons and that ghosty and probably. Both and this other common, and both of them were over ten pound, I'd say. So, if we we're just going to show you, this is what we we're going to show you. We we're going to show you our rigs we were using. I said SOS iconic baits, really nice. And here's the pot. It comes with nice pop ups. We've also got these juicy pineapple ones. Which are uh, like these dumbbell wafters, which smell really nice. So, this is pineapple and squid. So, and then in here, we got the SOS micro pellets, along with some normal micro pellets and some nice sea salt. Nice solid bags there as well. So, yeah. We've got the third rod back out now after that double take, and we can get back to fishing. So, yeah. So, this is the same rod again, new one in the same spot, SOS, same everything. What's been working? Just as Dad was saying, um, I had a in a little oil. Well, more like it was like 10 minutes, but still a oil for the state bait. It's a bit bigger. Not, oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. This is bigger. Yeah, well, it's from the first time I picked up a rod. rod I knew this was bigger. It's just a bit heavy. 
I think he's going to that snap. He's trying to get over there, isn't he? Yep, I know what he's doing. I know exactly what you're doing. That's quite a sizable one. Oh, that's a lump. It's good. That's a pretty big one. <coughs> oh. See it? It's a bit bigger, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit bigger one. What sort of size do you think? I mean, it's mm. 17, 18? Yeah, something like that from looking at from here. It could be anything though. Right. Let's go and try to sort this one out as well. Yep. Right. Well, this is the biggest one of the day so far. It's on the same rod with SOS weed again. Same everything. And yeah, it's quite a big one this one. I'll give it, we'll weigh it after. We haven't weighed it yet though. But I'm guessing about 16 pound. But, yeah. It's a bit lively, this one. I'll get some photos and get them back. So this is the third fish of the day, same spot, it's 15 pounds this one was, biggest of the day. Them. So there we go, back into the water. Alright, we're going to get the rod back out now and wait for another bite. It feels like another big one. We just lost the little one. Didn't bother recording the little one. We lost it anyway. It was too small. But we got this. But it was kind of like a drop back run. So I thought it would be little. But picked it up and it's actually quite big. But it feels with it. Yeah. Number four. Oh, it's been a good day today. Well, we just had four runs after the last fish we showed you. We landed two of them, both small, so we didn't bother showing you, and we lost um, two of them. So it's a pretty good day today. Can't really keep three rods in the water, but they were all on the SOS iconic baits again. It's the main bait we're using today, and most of them 
three of the ones being on the usual spot, and one of them was down in the corner over there. So, it's gone really good today. I um, hope we get more fish. So, yeah. So this is probably going to be our last fish. It's been quiet for the last hour. Uh, I think it's decent, it's decent size. Not the massive on what underneath. <sighs> this is more. So this is probably the last fish of the day. It's been a brilliant day fishing. We've I think we've caught about eight or seven fish. Which is just a normal size, nothing special, but yeah. Let's put this one back and then pack up. Well, we had one more fish before we went after that last fish we showed you, and it was a pretty nice. Um, this was a nothing special, just a nice common, and we packed it up. And it turned out that SOS iconic baits they work really well, and we're definitely going to use them again and carry on sponsoring them. So make remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.